My friend Travis over at the Cisco Learning Network asks a great question. Would the T-shoot exam be valuable assistance for me in the troubleshooting section of the CCIE practical lab? The answer, a resounding yes. Absolutely it would. As a matter of fact, the new and improved CCNP track from Cisco is better prepped than ever for your expert level certifications. I often found that the number one issue with candidates in my CCIE training was that they didn't really go the distance. They didn't really put the effort they needed to into their CCENP training, and that's why they were so struggling to achieve the CCIE. I love the idea that Travis came up with of T-Shoot for CCIE prep, and let's take a look at exactly why. Cisco gives us the exact topology and the exact technologies that you're going to use in T-Shoot. So you want to memorize this. The better you know this, the better you'll be prepared for T-Shoot. And when you look at this list of technologies, you see that it goes pretty vast in scope. We've got multiple area OSPF. We've got EIGRP. We've got some various services like web and FTP services. We've got a DHCP server here. We've got a network address translation device there. And it even gets better. If you go and you take a look at the uh, layer three topology for IPv6, we see that we're gonna get to gain some valuable experience in troubleshooting v6. And then when you look at your layer two topology, you see that you're really gonna get put, put through your paces when it comes to the layer two design. We'll be doing things in here like troubleshooting ether channels, troubleshooting VTP, VLAN assignments, etc. Now, while this scope is pretty decently vast for your troubleshooting experience, please note that it doesn't cover the full CCIE routing and switching blueprint. So yeah, T-Shoot's going to be an excellent, excellent way in which to prep, but I do want you to keep in mind that the scope of the CCIE Route Switch Practical Lab is going to go beyond those technologies that you find in those topology diagrams that you're going to encounter in T-Shoot. Well, thanks so much for watching, and Travis, thanks so much for the awesome question.